Kids, I have one more nifty trick for you that I normally would do in class. You can do this at home. All you need is an empty soda bottle, the larger the better. You know how much I love plastic, but in this case, it's kind of cool. Empty plastic soda bottle, really hot water, and a match, or if you don't have matches, then maybe a lighter and incense. We need some smoke. Watch this. Hold on. Okay. Empty soda bottle. Cap. This is really hot water. Now, you can see that it's steaming. Let me bring this down a little. But as soon as you get kind of far away from the, from the heat, that steam disappears. What's happening right here is that first, this liquid is turning into a vapor. That vapor is very quickly condensing when it hits this much cooler air. That's creating this steam. This steam is basically a cloud. But if I just lower that, uh, now up here, you can't see any more steam because it has re-evaporated, turned back into a vapor. Remember that vapor is invisible. So what you see as steam, that's a cloud. That's invisible. That's because it's liquid water. If I put my hand over this for just a moment, my, my hand feels wet be because it is wet. So here's a neat way to demonstrate not only cloud formation, but that happy high, cool and dry, sunny high, cool and dry, and cloudy low, warmer rain or snow. If you have an empty soda bottle and some very hot water, I'm going to pour a little bit of hot water into this. This is actually hotter than I usually use it. So why hot? Because I want some vapor. And I just, just a little bit in the bottom. You don't, you don't need much, okay? So now that hot water is steaming. And normally in class, I would use a match. I, I don't have matches at home, but I have some incense. I like incense. Why do I want incense? Because I want condensation nuclei. I want some smoke. So I'm just going to kind of let this smolder for a moment in this bottle. I'm just going to get some condensation nuclei in there. Uh, so I'm, I'm combining water vapor, liquid water, and some condensation nuclei, okay? That's probably enough. And I'm going to, let me just get rid of the incense. Okay. Not burn the house down. And I'm going to cap it. Okay. Now you can see that the bottle's kind of cloudy, right? I'm going to squeeze it. And I'm going to give it a shake. Can you see that it kind of cleared up? It's kind of, it's kind of clear right now. But if I let it go and release this high pressure, can you see that there's like a little cloud in the bottle now? But if I squeeze it again, it clears up. Can you see that? Clear, cloudy. Clear, high pressure, cloudy. Can you see that cloud in the bottle? I'm hoping you can see this. Give it a shake. And I, when I squeeze it, it's clear. When I release it, it becomes a cloud. And if I open this, you can actually, you can actually see that. Oh, that's not smoke anymore. That's cloud, because it disappears. It disappears, right? Let me give it a shake. High pressure, nice and clear. Low pressure, cloudy. High pressure, nice and clear. Low pressure, cloudy. Happy high, cool and dry. Cloudy low, warmer rain or snow. Sunny high, cool and dry. High pressure. Low pressure. High pressure. Low pressure. Isn't that cool? All you need is a little bit of condensation. Ooh, condensation nuclei. A plastic bottle and then recycle this and don't ever buy them again. Hope you enjoyed my little cloud demo. Try it at home.